Okay guys, loads going on this afternoon as we may be hitting in with a triple upload today with loads of things going on. So make sure you stay tuned to the channel because later on hopefully we should have some better news to report. But as of right now, we've got loads of things to dive into all the same, including the major order being finally completed and the new mech suits being ready for deployment. On top of that, we've got an apology coming out from the developer that caused all of the ruckus on Discord. And we have got some talks around the game actually not working at the moment. I don't really know what that means, but we've got some things that we can talk about today. If you haven't already, smash that beautiful blue thumbs up and subscribe with post notifications turned on. It'd be greatly appreciated. On top of that, check out our sponsor, Control Freak, the number one in controller gaming aiming. That's right, we made it rhyme. But if you go down to the description and click the link today, you'll be able to utilize code CloudPlays for a cheeky 12% discount, which is much better than 10. But with that being said, let's dive on into the information at hand today. So before we get into anything, I've just jumped on to get a video up for you guys. I wanted to get some new gameplay, go and play a few games and stuff like that. And I couldn't even get onto the server. The problem with the game right now, I don't really know what it is, but I've tried to load it up. It was a little bit glippy at the beginning. Wasn't able to cut the cutscene. Couldn't skip it. Just had to watch the cutscene all the way through at the beginning. And then was not able to join the server and was just waiting and is not really doing anything and even now to this point it's still not doing anything we went into the discord and all of you guys that are a part of it have reiterated that you've got exactly the same problem the non-skippable cutscene is an issue you can't get into the game it's a little bit crazy a little bit mental but if you guys want to get involved and keep up to date with some of the stuff a little bit more live service to the model then um go into the discord the link is down in the description there are so many amazing people in there and we're having such a great time communicating and talking and discussing parts of the game it'd be great if you can get involved plus we're always able to help each other out and keep each other in the loop with what's going on with issues like we're having today because as of right now at around 4 30 p.m in the uk i've seen absolutely no statement made by arrowhead not by johan the ceo i've not seen anything go up on the discord we've not had absolutely anything come through from them whatsoever so as to what is that's going on with the game i have no idea apparently according to subscribers in the discord though they are stating that they were on about an hour ago at the point of recording and they had like loads and loads of issues inside of the game what it is that's the problem i don't really really know maybe somebody was messing around with things no idea but apparently the rec shop could not be used was unable to purchase from the war bond there was like loads of issues in there so no idea what's going on right now we have to wait for an official statement from arrowhead but later tonight once everything is said and done we'll have another video release where we can tell you guys what it is that happened why it's happened and hopefully that the servers are all back online but as of right now we're all struggling to get on do not panic you are not alone next up now well, we've got past that part though we have obviously defeated the major order we've managed to get the mechs that's all well and good i don't know if that means that the mechs are now available it states that they've been deployed but again no one's inside of the game so like realistically i have no bloody idea what's going on with it it may be available maybe everybody's jumped on now the mechs are available and the servers have actually just ramped up just by taking a look at the hell divers db I can see that currently on the PC side of things, there's about a quarter of a million people playing currently. So I don't even think that that's it. I'm a little bit confused as to what's happening, but yeah, make sure you stay tuned to the channel. As soon as we know anything, you guys will know something. But moving on to the devs apology. For those of you guys who don't know, we've been keeping up to date on everything going on around the game and around the development team and the company of Arrowhead. And fortunately, there was a developer that had a bit of a hot-headed moment. He was receiving a lot of, a lot of hate with regards to the patch and may have just lost his temper a little bit obviously we've had a statement come out from the ceo of arrowhead who has essentially said that they've had talks and there was like retraining within the social media training side of things and obviously he's had a bit of a telling off but evil bossy has turned around and made the following statements in the discord of hell divers 2 stating i acted like an ass had a temper tantrum realized that it was a shit thing to do both to the community and myself so now i'm here trying to slowly make amends nah i'm not expecting everyone to forgive me by just me coming back and saying sorry earning trust back is harder than earning it the first time i gotta earn my f my respect first and hopefully i can bring some amounts of arrowhead with me 
I acted like an ass to people, no denying that. I don't want to pretend it didn't happen either. I will just try my best to earn the respect back. And there are a few other statements, but he obviously can completely agree with what everyone was saying. And he's obviously put his hands up to the fact that he was acting like a bit of an ass hat. And fair play to him, man. Uh, I think if you're receiving that amount of hate, it can sometimes be difficult to not hit a hot headed point and bite back. And to be completely honest, like I feel like we've all done it neither here or there for me i'm not really too bothered i think it's just one of those things he's getting his retraining on social media work and that's just how it runs so let's stop giving him so much grief now and let's let him regain his trust in us there's a lot of things going on with regards to the game and realistically this stuff in the back end with the development team and stuff like that shouldn't really be the biggest thing that we're talking about and the biggest thing to worry about so maybe we can just move on from it now and hope that he's obviously learned the lesson and is not going to reiterate the issues that were at hand beforehand Next up, though, we have seen a bit of a problem with regards to the medals from the Major Order. Apparently, people have reported that they've received their medals from this recent Major Order, trying to obviously obtain the mechs and get them back and get the production line rerunning again. They've managed to get their medals for that one, although it does seem that the one from the previous Major Order still has not been paid out. I don't really get it. I haven't seen it. I know a lot of people are talking about it. My comment sections are flooded with it as well as the discord as well so it does seem to be a bit of a stagnant footprint right now i think what they need to do is just kind of like tread very carefully at this point the servers right now are down the discord has gone absolutely haywire and everybody is freaking out people aren't getting their medals we're not able to use the mechs that we've just worked for we're also having a bit of a problem inside of the game as well with stores and stuff like that when you eventually can get on it and it seems to be a bit of a dark day for hell divers too it's really weird one we've had a really good week and everything's been going so damn well but unfortunately it seems like something has become the problem we are not seeing any announcement still at the point of recording 10 minutes later still see nothing on the discord and everybody's going rampant so make sure you stay tuned to the channel for that one because we're going to keep you guys as up to date as we can if you guys want to stick comments down in the comment section just to let everybody know because obviously i will not be updating you guys for at least another five to six hours from this point with regards to what happened and why it's happened the way that it's happened to make sure that i can get all the info i can when the servers are back up and running if you are watching this video at the time make sure you get into the comment section and let everybody know that it's all up and running again on top of that though at this point we are now giving away the copy of Helldivers 2 and if you've already got the game we're going to be giving away the super credits equivalent to it this is going to be happening over the next couple of days so make sure you stay tuned we're going to put it up on one of the videos as far as who's won the first one and then we can move on to the next one at large but if you guys want to get involved with it today head down to the comment section right now and stick a yellow heart in the comment section all you got to do is stick a yellow heart in and I will be in touch with you and we'll get organization of getting you that stuff sorted out Hopefully the servers get fixed soon. Hopefully we can get back in and fight for democracy soon. But as far as I'm aware, absolutely nothing is happening. Head down to the description and get in the Discord so you've got all your live updates. And make sure you stay tuned for what it is that's going to be coming up later on today. Bit of a rambled one and a bit of an unorganized video today. So I can only apologize. This one was a little bit on the fly because realistically I don't understand what's going on. So I can only give you guys so much information. But that's all you got from me today. Make sure you smash the like button and subscribe, post notifications turned on. And I will see you guys in about four or five hours from this point of upload. Thanks again for watching. Appreciate your faces. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the clouds.